And I'm gonna try and turn my store into a bit of a maze just to be an idiot. Oh yeah, here we go. We've got a guy coming in. He's going to attempt to run the gauntlet of shells. How's it going everybody? My name is Finplay and we're back. We're playing RPG Simulator. Today we're going to try and unlock some more upgrades. I want the upgrade that gets more people coming in and trying to sell me rare stuff. Because I want to see what rare weapons we can get. I'm going to open my store because all the shelves are stocked now. An overwhelming number of people have told me to try sticking my bow across the door. So I'm going to give that a crack shortly. But I just wanted to point out how awesome the shield is. It's like a bear's face or a demon's face or something. I'm gonna go and try and find some dead bodies in the forest and see if they've dropped any armor and stuff. Oh, there's a dead guy over there. I'm gonna find him. I'm gonna raid his body, see if we can get some mad loot. Man, it better be good. Hey champ, what do you got? He's got a crappy sword. This thing's like half rusted. Like he's used it to scratch his bum or something. What's going on in the store? No one's here yet. It's called a poor man's sword. You've got that right. <laughs> this sword looks like it has the zombie virus. There's a dude. He's coming in. Yep, all right. He just bought an ax. Wise choice. Wow. Wow. We're busy. We are busy. This is good. This is good. Look out, champ. All right, I'm gonna put my bow across the door. Okay, let's just put that there and see if people get away. Here we go, here we go. <laughs> yes, that is so effective. Oh God, there are so many people, they're actually running into each other and stuff. That was some serious big brain time. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, she made it out. She made it out! What? Oh, I leveled up. Someone got away with some stuff. Got her. Who else is coming? That dude. I'm just gonna stand here. Here's a good spot. There's a guy. So, it seems like I need like a bigger sword in able to be able to do that. You know what I mean? <laughs> what is that guy doing? Champ, get out of my shelves, dude. Just get out of them. All right, looks like I've looks like I've got someone moving in. Okay, so this guy wants to sell me a Moonlight Sword 2. I'll buy that. I like this thing. Looks like it's from Kingdom Hearts. I'll take it. Put it on the shelf. I had a lot of stuff uh, get stolen that time. Did anyone notice? There was like so much stuff. Dude, get out of my shop. All right, I'm gonna delete that shelf. Where is this guy going? The door is that way, champ. Okay, all right, let's just ignore him. Now we need to stock the shelves again. And then we're gonna go look for some more dead bodies <laughs> to get some awesome loot. And uh, we might even craft a rare sword as well. What you selling, champ? What's he got? My uh, guild sword. All right. Oh, what? This thing looks incredibly cool. Look at it. Hey, wise choice. By the divine power in this object, I will slay Satan. Oh, no, no, no. Where's my bow? That's not a bow. She's she's ducked off with my sword. Oh, what? Oh, almost. Oh, God. God, get, oi, give it back. Grab an arrow. Got it. Okay. What? What? <laughs> it's like three. Stop nicking all my gear. There. Take that. Let's see you get past. Oh, dude. Dude, <laughs> it's got my hammer. It stops some of them. Man, this shop is a shambles. I reckon I just leave that bow on the floor. I reckon it stays right there. Because that'll catch a good portion of the thieves. It won't get all of them, but it will get quite a few. Man, the shop was looking nice, and now it looks just crap. And this guy's still here. All right, I'm gonna delete this shelf. All right, where's he gonna go? <laughs> he bought two things. Let's get this next upgrade. Where is this thing? I've got a thousand points, right? And I've got a few upgrades I can buy. What do we got here? The rogue set. All right, I'm gonna go for rogue customers and wizard customers. Uh, some more guys, they've dropped this cool looking sword. I like this one. Got another fella on the ground. That's a pretty cool looking staff, dude. This guy dropped a hero potion. 
These things are worth heaps. Like, I could probably sell this for about 500 to 600 gold. I'm definitely keeping that. Now if we could just find ourselves some toilet paper to sell. That's where the real money is. Everybody poops. Everybody poops. This place is an absolute mess every time I come in here. Alright, let's not worry about it. Ice King Sword. That's the one I'm making. That's gonna be cool. Alright, so we get some iron. We need to heat this iron up to 460 degrees. I think there's someone in the shop. I'm gonna head back to the shop. Is there someone here wanting to sell me something? Oh, it's a dude! It's a phoenix sword! Oh, yes! Look at this! I wonder if this is one of the rogue items. Alright, bakers, it's time to get to bacon. Let's do this. Uh, get all this crap off my anvil. Alright, blue crystal. Yeah, buddy. Right, another blue one. Done. Alright, there we go. Now we make a giant stack. Just give it a whack until we get a sword. Yeah, dude! Nice! That wasn't too hard at all. That was actually one of the easiest builds. I mean, I don't know if I'm just getting better at it or not, though. But that looks really cool. Alright, I'm gonna pick it up with your bare hands. You can do that with, with swords that are, you know, molten hot. It's fine. Slap this button. And then just start grinding away until you get that awesome looking Ice King sword. Look at that! You don't even need to forge this thing in the fires of a volcano. Or an ice cave or anything like that. You just do it in your backyard. It's fine. Just <laughs> it's even got this cool little ice magic thing there for some reason. Alright, I'm gonna put that one in my pocket. I'm gonna head back to my store to see what's happening. Alright, got these two swords. I'm gonna put those there. Then I'm gonna go quickly set the prices before someone buys them. Okay, that Phoenix sword is 560. That's pretty good. Oh, here comes a guy. I wonder if he's gonna buy this Phoenix sword. Buy it, dude. It's a really good choice. Trust me. You can tell because it's got feathers and crap on it. He just did. 560. Thank you very much. Guy's got a sore hip. Look at the way he's walking. Here comes a dude. Let's see what he's gonna try and sell me. It better be good or I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> Is it some rogue stuff? It's a poor man's bow for 48 gold. What can you even sell this thing for, dude? I'm not even gonna try and sell it for a lot of money. I'm just gonna stick it there. Who cares? Oh, that's a good looking shelf. Look at that shelf. Got the demon heads and everything. I like them. I have 24 epic potions on my shelf here right now. Are you gonna be our first thief? Yeah. No, no, he's legitimately buying it. <laughs> Look at all these people coming in! <laughs> this is so cool! Sorry guys, I'm fresh out of TP, but I've got loads of potions. Oh, this guy didn't want that one. Oh, this is insane. This is insane. Nobody has- there's one! There's one! Oh. <laughs> oh, he actually got out. Well, there's two women out there having a disagreement. What are they arguing about? She's like, give me that snake potion. Like, no. No, why do you look exactly like me? Oh, she's gonna try and sell me something. What are you gonna try and sell me? What you got? What is it? <laughs> Angel guard sword. Heck yes. <laughs> Dude, look at this sword. That's a cool looking sword. I've sold one of these before. I'm gonna stick that right there. Lady's gonna buy the angel sword? Hmm. No, she's not. She's just gonna steal it. <laughs> All right. So much for my bow stopping everybody. Oh, come on, champ. Come on, champ. <laughs> Okay, I just restocked those potions, right? So all of the potions that I had on the shelf were either stolen or they were actually sold. If we go over here, there's only two potions that were stolen that we actually ended up on the ground. We're almost about to level up and then we'll be level 10. Once we're level 10, we're gonna be able to buy like bows. We can get the level, level three set of rogue stuff and possibly even pay for this wizard level 3 stuff as well. I'm not gonna worry about upgrading this, which gives you more money. Um, I've got like a lot of money anyway. Oh, what's this guy got? Elite guard something. What is this? What? I haven't seen this sword. This one looks really cool. So I've got 1400. That's actually enough to upgrade both of these things. So now we get Venom Queen bow. What is that? High shaman bow. Once everyone's bought everything, I'm gonna try setting up my store in a way that turns it into a bit of a maze. <laughs> T 
just so I can see. Not so much trap people in here, but make it difficult for them to get out. All right, there we go. I'm deleting all of my shelves and everything. Oh, look at that. We've got a spider potion left. Now, I'm going to buy a stack load of shelves and things, and I'm going to try and turn my store into a bit of a maze just to be an idiot. Oh, here's this bunch of stuff I just bought. Look at this oracle stuff. It's like a stack of eyeballs. I just bought a heap of these weapon racks. Let's put these at the front of the store. I'm going to put one right there. That way, everybody has to walk over that bow. <laughs> See that? Big brain move. That's a brilliant idea. Look at this. Just line them up in a row. Why can't we put any more in? Is the maximum four of these things? What? For some reason, the spacing on this side can't be that close. But on this side, it can. All right, then I'll stick some tables on this side. Now, it's not so much of a maze, right? But have you seen these NPCs try and get like around <laughs> just a regular shelf at the best of times? They get stuck big time. All right, let's put this down there. Can I put that on there? I don't think I can. I'm gonna put a sword there. And we're gonna see if anyone can actually get in and buy this sword. This is gonna be awesome. I'm gonna put some stuff over here as well. We'll see if we can get to that. Can I? I can't walk out of there either. I have to walk around all these shelves. Oh yeah, here we go. We've got a guy coming in. He's going to attempt to run the gauntlet of shelves. Here we go. What's gonna happen? Where'd my hands just go? All right, here he goes. He's beelining this plant sword. Oh, oh, he did it! He just used wall hacks and went right between that shelf. How is he gonna get out of the store though? Can he make it out? Oh, nah. <laughs> this guy right here is having a fair crack. Let's see where he goes. Are you gonna get lost forever? It's like, oh crap. I want to try and get to that cool looking stuff with the eyeballs, but I don't know how to navigate this store because I'm a dummy dum dum. Just walk around the long way. <laughs> Poor dude. Oh, look at this move. This guy is trying to get in here, but this guy is already stuck. So now this dude's practically climbing on top of that guy to get to the shelves. It's like Black Friday sales. This is good. What's going to happen with all these people? <laughs> Yes. Oh, oh. She's smarter than the rest. She's walked straight through a table. Oh. She's used actual wall hacks. Look at that. That is clever. That is way clever. Well done. You deserve that stuff. <laughs> All these men are stupid. One woman walks in here, buys what she wants and leaves. These men don't know how to shop at all. I've severely broken my store. If you guys have got some ideas of some stuff, you want to see me try my store, let me know in the comments. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you liked it, give us one of these ones. I'll see you guys next time.